welcome back to my fitness coach where we're all about helping you reach your fitness goals. Today, we're tackling a topic that's been shrouded in confusion. The real differences between men and women when it comes to fitness training. Let's dive in and clear the air on the six key distinctions. Difference number one, minor training variations. First up, the myth that men and women need drastically different workouts. It's time to set the record straight. While gender may bring some nuances, the core principles of effective training remain constant. You see, it's not about rewriting the rulebook for each gender. Instead, it's about making minor adjustments that suit individual goals and preferences. Difference number two, hormones and recovery. Now, let's talk hormones. Women, listen up. You've got a biological advantage. Estrogen, with around nine times more estrogen than men, your recovery system is like a finely tuned engine. This means you can handle more training volume, more reps, and more frequent workouts. So ladies, embrace your hormonal gift and leverage it for those gains. Difference number three, fatigue abilities. Fatigue may seem like an equalizer, but here's the twist, women have the edge. Thanks to factors like improved blood flow and muscle perfusion, they clear out fatigue-inducing waste products more swiftly, but that's not all. Their muscle fiber composition is tailored for endurance, allowing them to excel in higher rep ranges. Ladies, get ready to power through those extended sets. Difference number four, explosive vs. endurance training. Moving on to training styles, man. You're wired for explosive power. Those fast twitch muscle fibers of yours thrive when you focus on dynamic, high intensity exercises. Now, ladies, your strengths lie in endurance. Your muscle fibers are optimized for sustained effort, making higher rep ranges your playground. Embrace these differences and tailor your training accordingly. Difference number five, upper versus lower body strength. Now the upper verse, lower body strength debate. Ladies, here's an interesting fact. You boast around 66 of the lower body strength compared to men. So while the bench press might be a challenge, you shine when it comes to squats and lunges. Gentlemen, take a page from the women's playbook and focus on balancing upper and lower body strengths. Difference number six, muscle gain potential Lastly, let's talk muscle gain potential. Some say men have the upper hand in this department. Uh, and while it's true that men have a slightly higher muscle building potential due to testosterone, the gap isn't insurmountable. Women, you absolutely can build significant muscle. Don't shy away from lifting weights. Your potential is more impressive than you might think. And there you have it, the six key differences in gender-based fitness training. Remember, these distinctions are not roadblocks, but rather signposts guiding you on your fitness journey. Regardless of gender, the pursuit of health and strength knows no bounds. Thanks for joining us today, fitness enthusiasts. If this information resonated with you, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button to join the My Fitness Coach community. Until next time, keep celebrating your uniqueness, pushing your limits and striving for your personal best. Stay motivated and stay strong. Try my fitness coach app for 500 workouts, 950 recipes, curated diet plans. We would love to have you on board. Share your thoughts, experiences, and any additional tips you might have in the comments below. And as always, stay motivated, stay dedicated, and I'll catch you in the next video.